So let's talk about some of the other things, the other ways to capture footage. Uh, we've primarily talked so far about capturing stuff from file-based cameras, but you can also capture from tape-based cameras or just from uh, a loose camera, such as the built-in EyeSight camera. Hey, so you can actually capture directly from your EyeSight camera just by going to here and then just clicking uh, import, and it's going to start doing a live capture. It again gives you the same options to analyze and what format to set it in. And right now, it's capturing a live shot of what we're talking about here. It's going to add this to the Mac Pro video. At any point, I can just stop import, and then it's going to uh, we close that. We go into our uh, import file here, and there's the footage that we just format to set it in. And right now, it's capturing a live shot of what we're talking about here. It's going to add this to the Mac Pro video. At any point, I can just stop. <laughs> and there you go. So you can do a live capture like that. And you can also capture from a camera uh, like a, a tape-based camcorder, such as like an HV20, which I have connected. Let me just uh, set that up real quick. So we can open up the camera window again and uh, choose the HV20. And there you see the we, we have device control, so we can play or pause the clip, the camera. And uh, if you don't like the area, you're fine. You can rewind or fast forward. Let's just fast forward a little bit here. All right, here's a little bit more interesting section, making this big hunk of bread dough. <laughs> and uh, so and at any point you want to start capturing, just click the import button. You set the options you like, and then it begins to start importing. And you see there the seconds are indicating the uh, amount of time that's being captured. And... Uh, whenever you're bored of watching somebody mess with all this dough, just click Stop Import. And then the uh, playback stops, close the window, and if you look here in our, in our event, there is the same clip. And so you can, uh, you know, that footage has been captured. It's been copied into your movies folder in that same directory as those other folders. In this case, I'm in the Mac Pro Video folder, um, but this is a way to capture directly from a camera.